good afternoon dear students in the last class we are discussed about the enrichment of ores and extracting metals low in the activity series okay from the cinnabar cinnabar is a ore of mercury cinnabar is a ore of mercury that is mercuric sulfide hgs okay from that we can obtain the pure metal that is the mercury it will be converted into the mercuric oxide and after that mercuric oxide if we heat means we can obtain the pure mercury okay up to here we are discussing it. and today i am going to discuss about the extracting metals in the middle of the activity series okay extracting metals extracting metals extracting metals in the middle of the activity series in the middle of the activity series middle of the extracting extracting metals in the middle of the activity series now how can we extract the metals in the middle of the activity series the metals in the middle of the activity series such as what are the middle of the activity series metals already we are discussed iron zinc lead copper are moderately reactive metals what are that iron and zinc and lead lead symbol P B iron zinc lead these are the moderative reactive metals okay iron zinc lead these lead and copper these are the moderative reactive metals okay the metals in the middle of the activity series such as iron zinc lead copper are moderately reactive these are usually present as sulfides are carbonates in nature generally middle of the activity series metal, metals are usually present as sulfides or carbonates in nature okay they are find uh, they are found in the nature as a sulfides and carbonates it is easier to obtain a metal from its oxide okay compare than sulfides and carbonates we can obtain pure metal from the metal oxide is easily metal obtained from the metal oxide is easy from its oxides okay so as compared to its sulfides and carbonates compared to sulfides and carbonates we can obtain the metal pure metal from the oxide is easily okay and now the moderative reactive metals moderately the moderately reactive metals moderately reactive metals usually usually present as usually present as sulfides or carbonates in nature sulfides or carbonates usually sulfides are carbonates in nature okay generally moderate reactive metals are usually present as sulfides are carbonates in nature it is easier to obtain a metal from its oxide it is easier to it is easier to obtain a metal from its oxide its oxide as compared to its sulfides and carbonates as compared to as compared 
as compared to its sulfides and carbonates okay that means it is easier to obtain a metal from its oxide as compared to its sulfides and carbonates okay therefore prior to reduction the metal sulfides and carbonates must be converted into metal oxide that's why metal oxides we can convert into the pure metal by the reduction okay therefore prior to reduction therefore prior to reduction prior to reduction carbonates therefore prior to reaction therefore prior to reduction okay and uh, the metal sulfides and carbonates must be converted into metal oxides the sulfide ores are converted into oxide ore by heating strongly okay now we have to discuss about the roasting what is the roasting method here the sulfides and carbonates must and should we have to convert into their oxides okay metal sulfides metal sulfides and carbonates metal sulfides and carbonates we have to convert ores are convert converted into metal oxides metal oxides now roasting what is the roasting now roasting what is the roasting how can we define the roasting the process which process the sulfide ores are converted into oxide by heating strongly in the presence of excess air is called roasting okay what is the process what is the roasting mean the process of okay the process of sulfide ores convert into the oxide ores okay by the excess of air is called that is roasting okay the sulfide ores the sulfide ores sulfide and carbonate ores are the sulfide ores are converted into converted into sulfide ores are converted into oxides oxides by heating strongly by heating strongly in the presence of excess air in the presence of excess air is called roasting is called roast but this is called roasting roasting means the sulfide ores are converted into oxide ores by heating strongly in the presence of excess air is called roasting that means sulfide ore we are converting into which one oxide ore that is called roasting okay i will give the one example for roasting here we have to take the zinc sulfide zinc sulfide so roasting roasting means what sulfide ores are converted into the oxide ores we are taking the one example zinc sulfide okay in the presence of excess air oxygen air means oxygen oxygen is a gas okay on heating how it will be convert it will be convert into zinc oxide zinc oxide means this is a oxide okay plus 2 so2 this is a gas zinc oxide is a solid this is called roasting okay roasting means what 
sulfide ores are converted into the oxide ores by heating excess of presence of excess air is called roasting okay example of the roasting is zinc sulfide this is a sulfide ore in the presence of excess air we are heating it will be converted into zinc oxide oxide means this is a we are converting the metal oxide okay metal sulfide converting into the metal oxide this is called roasting okay 